Well, you've probably heard of it, hand, foot, and mouth disease, but you've also probably heard only really young kids get it. Well, in the past few months, there have been outbreaks on college campuses. LEX 18's Claire Kopsky brings us more about the illness and where it's popping up in central Kentucky. Rash that may be preceded by a fever and escalated to painful blisters. It's called hand, foot, and mouth disease, and despite being more common in children, there have been recent outbreaks with more than 100 cases on individual college campuses, mostly on the East Coast. Got it actually really bad on my hands, really bad on my feet. This fall, there have also been at least seven cases on college campuses in our area, one at Eastern Kentucky University and at least six at UK, three of which were students. So patients usually going to present with a sore throat or sore mouth first. Dr. Hayes says the patients she's seen on UK's campus don't have her too worried. I would consider this an upper respiratory infection like a cold. I wouldn't... Um, I don't think it's any reason for panic. It's got a cool name and a cool presentation. Dr. Hayes says this virus is contagious on college campuses just like any other cold, but she says what you need to be careful of is the oozing from the blisters. If you were to touch things and the vesicular fluid gets on something, you would need to clean that surface off. So Clorox wipes after you lift weights, for instance, or wipe off your computer with a an antibacterial, antiviral wipe. She says you'll see different kinds of bumps on your skin, but the best thing you can do is stay hydrated and keep your hands clean. Covering the news in Lexington, Claire Kopsky, LEX 18 News.